Hamburg is located on the Elbe River in northern Germany and has one of the largest and busiest ports in Europe. Its location makes it an important link between the sea and Germany's network of inland waterways and numerous islands. The city is best known for its famous harbor area, and in addition to being a major transportation hub, Hamburg has been one of Europe's most important cultural and commercial centers, as well as a major tourist destination and one of the most vibrant cities in the world. Before we get into the top 10 things to do in Hamburg, we've included links in the description to various discount codes and links to resources of things to do, so make sure you check those out. At number 10 is the International Maritime Museum. Located in the oldest surviving storage building in the port of Hamburg, visitors can explore the nine decks of nautical history at Hamburg's impressive International Maritime Museum. See the Queen Mary II, constructed out of almost a million Lego bricks, Try your hand at sailing thanks to a fun steering wheel simulator and find out how captains of the past mastered navigation and communication. Journey through maritime progress and find out about Hamburg's amazing nautical past. Number 9 is Tierpark Hagenbeck. Visitors can discover more than 1,860 animals from all continents at the Tierpark Hagenbeck, including one of Europe's largest elephant herds and many free-roaming animals. Learn exciting new things about the animals during shows, or feed an elephant or a giraffe yourself. Among the park's 510 species are Asian elephants, leopards, orangutans, zebras, lions, and penguins. With its wonderful panoramas, outdoor enclosures, and many cultural buildings, the 19-hectare park delights visitors of all ages. At number 8 is the museum ship Rickmer Rickmers. A museum ship since 1983, the three-masted Rickmer Rickmers is one of Hamburg Harbor's most popular attractions. After almost 90 years of sailing the seven seas, the ship was turned into a museum. Today, visitors can roam the decks to explore the crew and officers' quarters, the galley and the engine room, and learn all about its voyages. Number 7 is Hamburg Kunsthalle. This impressive building hosts one of the most significant collections in Germany, featuring masterpieces from the Middle Ages till today. Travel through the history of art across two expansive wings and explore a collection of work by the German Romantics and intricate works by the Old Masters. Browse your way through the collections in spacious, well-designed galleries within this huge art museum that has something for every art lover. At number 6 is Plantan und Blaum. The Plantan und Blaum is a public park in central Hamburg and a wonderful destination for visitors and especially those seeking relaxation. There is a botanical garden with a tropical greenhouse, an alpine garden with mountain flowers, mosses and lichens, and one of the largest Japanese gardens in Europe. With playgrounds and other attractions for children, it makes a great family visit. Number 5 is the Wax Museum Panopticum. Germany's oldest wax museum is the perfect place to meet famous people from the worlds of history, politics, sport and music. The Panopticum in Hamburg is packed with waxy wonders, including all the national and international celebrities you've ever wanted to get a photo with. With over 120 figures to admire, get up close and personal with the stars at this fascinating Hamburg attraction. At number 4 is the museum ship Cap San Diego. Former cargo ship MS Cap San Diego has been turned into a floating museum and the 159 meter long vessel is one of the biggest seaworthy museum ships in the world. Stroll around on the different decks, and you can learn all about Cap San Diego's history, including how the officers dined, where they slept, and routes the ship took. Visitors can explore the boat with the audio guide, check out the exhibitions, or join a guided tour of the amazing vessel. Number 3 is St. Michael's Church. St. Michael's Church is in the center of the city, and in 1912, the construction of the church that we see today was finished. Visitors can explore the intricacies of one of the most impressive Protestant Baroque churches in Europe. Climb the tower to get a closer look at Germany's biggest clock bell and admire Hamburg city and harbor views from the observation deck at 106 meters above the Elbe River. At number 2 is the Elbe Philharmonie. Officially unveiled in 2017, the Elbe Philharmonie is Hamburg's tallest inhabited building at more than 100 meters. Visitors can explore one of the largest and most acoustically advanced concert halls in the world, learn about the Elbe Philharmonie's history, and hear about its role in Hamburg society. On the shimmering facade are around 1,000 curved windows, and at the very top is the plaza, an observation deck, and sleek cafe, both open to the public. And at number one is Minotaur Wunderland. Minotaur Wunderland is one of the world's largest model railroad systems and has become a main tourist highlight of Hamburg. Visitors can admire different countries and even an airport in miniature size. 
Besides the impressive miniature versions of Hamburg, the Austrian Alps, France, Italy, North America, and Scandinavia, there are 15.4 kilometers of railway track, and visitors can flick a total of 200 switches to control things like windmills, a helicopter, or space shuttle. So that sums up our top 10 things to do in Hamburg. We hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, and if you're new here, feel free to subscribe. Until next video, have a great day.